Canada's behavior with regard to Khalistani financing, the financing of extremism, certainly merits putting Canada on the Financial Action Task Force gray list, if not blacklist. As India becomes a more, um, uh, I mean, a, a major presence on the world stage, we need to listen to India and India's security concerns. Are there any lessons that uh, Justin Trudeau's government can draw from the way, uh, let's say, the Americas, because Khalistani goons are operating even out of American soil? Uh, how do we, how America has has uh, tackled the Khalistani threat on their soil versus how Trudeau's government is cozying up to the Khalistanis on his soil? Well, let's be frank. The Americans haven't done a good job either. We've seen that with regard to the attacks on the San Francisco consulate the vandalization of statues. I mean, when you have cameras in the region, there's no reason why we can't be more forthcoming about rolling up the criminals that have done this. There has to be a great deal more financial action. Um, I mean, frankly, and I wrote about this last year, Canada's behavior with regard to Khalistani financing, the financing of extremism, certainly merits putting Canada on the Financial Action Task Force gray list, if not blacklist. Um, we need to take what's going on very seriously, just because in Washington and Ottawa, traditionally, we haven't taken Khalistani separatism seriously, just because India Airlines 182 is now a forgotten memory, most people in the United States haven't even heard of it, doesn't mean that we can excuse this terrorism. As India becomes a more, um, uh, I mean, a, a major presence on the world stage, we need to listen to India and India's security concerns we need to listen to the security concerns of any democracy where extremists, where extremists who have no legitimacy inside the country decide to win through a bomb what they can't win at the ballot box. What the changes in India's population and the differential growth rate rationales about why it's not ending. What's your rationale? We have a very special we guest on the record. The interview. The role that the uh, US side played at that point of time. Puri dunia ki nazar. Zoom, my phone is tapped. I can probably say hello to Mr. Modi. Aapke Bharat par hai. Pakistan has a unique negotiating the style. rising confidence of India under Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Communist China is the greatest threat. There will come a day that we will see far more radical extremists. I'm, uh, I'm still a little perplexed by why we have... Your daily dose of news from India and across the world. Cutting edge views and analysis. Tune into HD videos. Click on the bell icon to subscribe.